Hey guys, John Eric here. Gonna show you a brick, some coasters, a uh, hood ornament, not a hood ornament, a, uh, <clears throat> a grill emblem, and some cool license plates, all Tennessee Titans themed. So I have a customer who is uh, infatuated with the Tennessee Titans. Here's his brick, <clears throat> here's his coasters. This, I'll show you this in a second. And we also made him a very cool license plate, uh, all Tennessee Titans themed. I'll, I'll explain that in a minute. We'll talk about his brick first. Um, if you've never been to my channel, thank you so much for coming. Please subscribe, hit the bell notifier, or yeah, hit the bell, whatever. Like it, do all that stuff. It helps my channel a lot. Uh, we make a lot of cool stuff like this. And uh, as of today, we'll be posting a video right after this. We're doing our first giveaway, a little bit late, but I'm gonna make it very special. I'm gonna give something very expensive away. So this is his brick. My boy's name is Lewis. He's one of my great customers. Uh, this one we did a diamond pattern all the way around. As you can see, it's a mirror finish. And we did a, uh, our own version of the Tennessee Titans logo. So if you've not seen bricks before, I'll bust this thing apart real quick and show you the difference, or not the difference, but what it is. So first of all, these are standard head Allen bolts, so any Allen tool will, uh, will open these. Uh, we do sand these down, uh, polish them on a machine, and polish them by hand to make them gorgeous. I like nice stuff. A brick is designed to hold cash. I think, I'm not positive, I think he's giving this away as a gift to his girlfriend. Don't quote me on that. I'm sure he's going to be watching this video. If he's not giving it to his girlfriend, he's going to kill me for saying that, so... Here we go. This one has a capacity of $50,000. This is US currency. This will also fit Canadian currency, European currency, no. Um, if you'd like to get a brick and you're in some other country besides US or Canada, let me know so I can be specific about how large I make the cutout for the cash. Uh, where it says the brick here and 50K here, there's matching spots on the lid. It says the brick here and 50K here. This 50 goes on top of this and so forth and so on. It locks in real nice. Anyway, uh, we do uh, stainless steel alignment sleeves here in the corners. This has it lined up so when there's no bolts in it, the lid doesn't shift around. This one, as I said, holds 50,000. I use funny money for my videos. Now, I used to use real cash, but you know how haters are on the internet. I'll just leave it at that. So here's uh, 10, 20, 30, 40, 50, 60, 50,000 in funny money. This video, if you watch lots of my videos, I know this gets repetitive, sorry, but a lot of people watch these videos, they're only watching the one video about their brick. So just in case that's the case with this one, uh, you got a finger slot here so you can reach in and get all your cash out. So I had to step away and take a call for a minute. I don't remember where I was at, so hopefully none of this is repetitive. So where I think I was is, uh, these videos are typically made for the person who is receiving their brick. This gentleman lives in Vegas, so I can go over all this with him in person, but typically I ship these out of state or out of country. So when it's time to put your brick back together, line up the 50K with the 50K. Turn it over. Now, if you don't have a soft surface like this leather pad, uh, we include with all of our bricks a nice piece of white foam. Uh, that it's wrapped in. Make sure you set the face on the white foam so you don't scratch it. A lot of time and energy goes into making these and polishing these and making these beautiful. And I'd like you to keep it that way as long as possible. Here we go. So that's it. This one's filled up. I will show you one thing that's different. This is a little newer design than another one uh, that we made a video about shortly or not shortly, a little while ago. So you see this mirrored border around here that goes around the feet and the bolts? That's something new we're doing. Uh, back when we were making these bricks, uh, we weren't doing that, we were just going across the whole thing. I like this better. In fact, I'd like to know from you guys, what do you like better? Do you like the border cut around everything better? Or do you like the pattern all the way through? <clears throat> I would be interested to hear what you guys think. I'm always curious to see if my design ideas are any good or not, per my viewers. So this is your 50K brick. I'm gonna set this aside real quick and show you these coasters that came out really, really nice. So this is a set of four coasters. These came out absolutely spectacular. 
I'll pull one out and show you the bottom as well. So there's the top, there's the side, of course, everything's mirror finished. And there's our logo right there. Looking beautiful. We put six feet on them for stability. Take them all off real quick. And here's the base. Uh, this is made out of a one inch thick, five inch by five inch <clears throat> piece of billet aluminum. Then these just screw in, not from the bottom. Actually, I can probably take one off and show you real quick how it works. I'm debating, we haven't shipped any of these yet, but I'm debating on whether or not I should ship, ship them disassembled or not. Um, they're really easy, can be done with no tools at all. But I'd be curious to know what you guys think. So this is a set screw, meaning a, a screw with no head. And this is the post that just goes down on there. So once all the posts are on, of course, on this one, we did the exact same design as we did on the coaster. Of course, God, that looks beautiful. We have our logo. Uh, this is the first time we took our logo full size, the bottom of a coaster holder. We used to do a much smaller version. I like it better like this. I may have another one here close by that I can show you. So this is an older one actually with the previous logo. And here's the new one. So do you like the right or the left? I like the left better, but I'm always curious what my audience thinks about our new uh, changes that we make. And this one's basically the same thing. It just holds more coasters. So there it is. There's a nice set of coasters there. Tell me what you guys think of those. And I'm still, I think we're still working on one or two more this one holds one more coaster, I think. Actually, let's do this. This one's quite a bit taller. This one, the design, this we did a mirror finish in here. This we did what's called a crosshatch finish. Let me know which design you like better also. He wanted both of them. He's putting these in two different uh, areas of his home or somewhere. But the bottoms are identical. The big difference is the number of coasters it holds. I'm just going to put a few on here. So we'll show you this one. So that's what they look like when it's full. And then second to last but not least, this is going on the grill of his Range Rover. This is going to cover up the, uh, well not cover up, but replace the Range Rover uh, emblem in the grill. And then last but not least, this is his license plate, or one of his license plates. We do these things called lower plate badges. It's a uh, 3 8 thick piece of polished aluminum, whatever design you want. Uh, this is the same thing but round. These both get screwed on. So the badge goes on with three security screws, the lower plate badge goes on. With security screws also. I like these better only because this will fit on any plate. This you've got to have room on the side of your plate to fit that. In Las Vegas this is actually a Raiders plate so I guess he's kind of stomping on the Raiders so. That's it for you Lewis. This is all your goodies. Um, I'm not going to take the money out. This video is getting kind of long already. I appreciate you guys watching. Like I said please give us a thumbs up if you like our content. Please subscribe to our channel. Uh, and the next video you see will be a giveaway video. You'll find out what that is in just a minute. See you guys. Thank you so much for watching.